Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Zips, and welcome back to Wild Frost. Today is probably going to be a day where I'm going to record some more than one video. I've got nothing much going on, so this is a good day to do it. And I can do math. If you guys are excited for some more Wild Frost, make sure to like and or comment and or subscribe. So, today, it is Snow Dwellers. Now let's see what kind of units we're playing. Let's see what kind of... So we got Poison Longshot, which looks kind of bad. Apply One Snow, which looks kind of bad. And Four Spice Behind, which looks pretty decent. We will do that. We will play as the Moon. It's... It's the... It's the Moon! It's... The Moon. It's the Moon. Nice. Uh, so, yeah, we're restarting the pet cycle. Also, we are restarting the pet cycle today. If you guys don't know how... If you guys don't know how we do pets on this series, the way we do it is we go take a random number generator, uh, random generate a number between 1 and 6, and depending on what we get, that, choose that chooses which pet we get, we play as. So if we get a 3, we play as Loki, and then we go right... Then we go right until we arrive back at Loki, in which case the cycle continues. So let's random number generate. Six. Well, Gazi. The moon is gonna is gonna go the is gonna go to the town. Ooh, I I kinda wanna try I kinda wanna try saving this. I do actually I wanna try saving this. S this naked gnome. I think this is actually a combat where we can achieve it. Because this clan can get some use out of. And certainly get some good use out of. Went out of. Out of a naked gnome. So we just gotta. We just have to get lucky here. Uh, I need to order it like this. I can hit the goblin. I can hit the goblin for a little bit of money. Okay, Snow Knight, please spawn bottom. Fuck! <laughs> uh, I don't know. Maybe it's possible. I'll try. We will try. I think it actually is. Okay, I think this. Yeah, since I have. I think this is actually possible to save the naked gnome. But I, okay, I need three scrappy swords here. We do have three scrappy swords. Yeah, it's actually pretty easy to save it. To save the naked gnome here. So what you do here, play woodhead top lane. You recall little, ga little Gazi. Then you do this, and yeah, this works out. Nice. Get over here, you dang gnome. You dang gnome. You dang. You dang little gnome. All right, let's take. Let's take this top half. Oh man, I just got better gnome. I just got the better gnome. I, I got better naked gnome and Blunky. Uh, I'll take Wart. I'm thinking. Take Wart. Just take Wart. Don't need to get... F Ooh, Mimic. I'll take this. That's a... Mimic is good. Hootie too? Uh... I don't know. I think I might just take a bomb bomb for the early game. Yeah, I'm gonna take. We'll take Naked Gnome out of the deck for now, and we'll play bomb bomb. Bomb bomb for this stage of the game is just pretty decent. 
Sadly, we got a terrible opening hand. Which, you know, after this... After the... Let's give this spice to Bomb Bomb. Now Bomb Bomb's got some serious DPS. DPS to her. So I need... I need Bomb Bomb to hit the bottom. So the best way you can do this is you let the Uber Bear hit you. And you, okay, so at the very least, it's a four kill here. Now, is there a way you can get anything better than a four kill? Or set up a situation where you can get something better than a four kill? The only way is if you hit got is if a wart hit hits goblin twice. But let's see if we, let's see if we can get lucky here. Damn it! I hit the wrong target. If I hit porcupine there, we could have gotten. We could have rolled high. Unforking it. Alright, just freeze. Alright, just freeze the goblin. Freeze the goblin for what it's worth. <laughs> early game with a bomba. Picking a bomb bomb or this early, and the fact that we can give like bomb bomb spice with our leader is gonna make this early game very easy. And strong early game is really good. strong early, early game is really powerful. Uh, do I want to try optimizing for money? I think I will. I don't really see why not. I don't get. I don't want to get hit by you, Snow Gobbler. Ah, wait. Fuck. I needed to switch. That. Eh, wait. No, there wasn't a way you could have done that. Okay, get out of here, Bumbo. Get out of here, dang bump, bumpster. Bottom path, 100, 100% bottom path. Mmm, pepper flag. And we have a leader that gives spice. Okay, okay, okay. I'll play, I'll play. And a dragon pepper? It's looking rather spicy today. Looking rather spicy. Give me a crown. I don't think since we have so much, so much attack. Uh, <laughs> I'll think about that. We keeping fifty dollars in the pocket feels pretty decent. I'm gonna yeah. Let's crown. Let's actually crown Pepper Flag here because I feel like it's gonna be a. Mm, I, I don't know actually. With all this attack generation. I think it's actually better to take Naked Gnome and take a Naked Gnome with you. Because if you can play Naked Gnome with Pepper Flag and... Okay, we got a second good target here for... Now, okay, so I think we have to be very careful in this fight. To be very careful of it in this fight are Snowbows. Because Snowbows can potentially snipe your clunkers. And make it real annoying. Yo, there he is. There he is. Now, is there any way I, I save Pepper Flag here? Damn, unfortunate. I don't think there is a way. I'm not too worried. I'm not too worried. We don't need Pepper Flag to win this fight. So. We got Bomb Bomb. Now what's the best course of action to do this turn? Do I play Bomb Bomb now? I'll play Bomb Bomb now. Woodhead blocks the top guy very well. 
Okay, Naked Gnome's pretty worthless here. It's pr right now, is pretty worthless, since we don't have... I do need to... Hit the Snow Gobbler. Bombo's health is looking a tiny bit low. Yeah, she can only attack one more time, and that's assuming she doesn't take damage. This might be a good time. This might be a good moment to play Sunrod on her. Although in that, although if you do, uh, yeah, I think it is fine if you do that. We'll have Wart hit this bottom lane. Sunrod. Ah, wait, shit. Shit. Hmm. My dumbass was not... was ignoring you. I need to think, is there an order you can get this off? I could let Wart die. But I don't really think that's wise. Damn, this just got kind of bad. Uh. Okay, I what I could still do, I could put... Naked Gnome here and let Bomb Bomb die. Now, do, would I need Bomb Bomb for the next? Would I really need Bomb Bomb for the next combat? I don't necessarily think I do need it. Yeah, I'm gonna let Bomb Bomb die. Hit this, kill this winter worm. It's getting kind of close here. It is getting a little bit close. This poison does do some good work, though. We should be in, in the clear. Okay, yeah. then we just scrappy sword. Take the kill. Not great. Oh, shit. Oh, god. My chair just did a weird, a weird thing there. All right, I will take the Sunveil charge and the, and the crown. I'll take the charm merchant. Hmm. I don't know. I'm not sure. So what I could do here, we could take Barrage Charm. Okay, I could give up on a crown here to play Pomegranate Charm. To, yeah, potentially play Pomegranate Charm on Mimic. <laughs> Sounds pretty decent. I think, I think, uh, no, I don't think I'm going to. I think I'm going to refrain from that. I took this top path because I wanted to remove some cards. <laughs> yeah, because then here you're able to get another crown. And we are going to be playing Naked Gnome. I think. Naked Gnome holds... Naked Gnome holds... Uh, I probably should have took a bomb... And you might need to play Bomb Bomb here. You you don't know. You don't... You don't know me. Dude, look at this. There he is. Look at this Gnome. He is number one. Nice. 
<laughs> Damn, Dragon Pepper makes this a lot nice. Makes this really nice. Get get down a mimic. You're dead. You can do something like this. I can't do something like this. I can do something like this. And that's a... Yeah, that's a 4 kill. Nice. Um... Nothing... That I super need to do here. Am I play Sunrod? Oh, uh, no, I should freeze the Shell Witch. Oh, wait. Eee, gross. Gross. I don't like that. Yeah, have him hit. We're probably just gonna kill this lane here. I should put let Naked Numb attack first. Okay, good. What I want to do... We're going to use Sunrod on... The Moon. I... It works. <laughs> it, it works. It works. It works. I forgot he'd be attacking. I was just focused on his effect. On the Moon's effect. Alright, get ready to die. Goblin. So this seems all r this this plan of attack seems all right. This seems super crazy, and we have. I could foresee later in the run we have like a lot of difficulty with with space, with managing space. But for the time being, this works. This I think this works pretty decently. Alright, take him out. Take him out, buddy. Get this shell witch. Wait, now you gotta do it like this to guarantee the multi kill. Then Wart gets the kill on shell witch. Shell witch is dead. And that's five extra doubloons in my pocket. I already removed some cards, so I'm good. No, we can't make Heart Forge work. So I'm good trying to check out, ch check on some charms. Cake charm. Hmm. So that's a course just good on flame water. I. I'll hold on to it for a second because there's something really funny we could put. Hmm. Great charm. Okay. Okay. Uh, I need to think. What? What do I? What would I rather want to play here? Ward with aimless. As okay. What do I want to play here? As like my main, as what I'm primarily giving attack to. <laughs> do I want to play? Greed charm, or wait now. Do I want to play wart or naked gnome? I don't know. Maybe, okay. Both of them have their benefits. I think Naked... Uh, I don't know. Naked Gnome is really fragile. 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 I'm gonna try it. Plus, we haven't had a funny looking Nick. I don't think I've ever actually done like a funny naked gnome. So we will try it. This fight looks. This fight should be fine. It's. 
Thank God it isn't Bone Cats. Bless the Lord that it is not Bone Cats. Okay, Bomb's kind of hard to do anything with here. I need to freeze this. We don't have a ton of health to work with. In this... With these units. We kind of just got a... A naked gnome that's hidden a, a bit hard. Do I recall ward here? I think I recall ward here. I want... I want Bomb Bomb's attack to go off. You kill Wooly Drek. And I'm good going for it again. So I need to I need to freeze one of the Grombles. Um, I don't know. So that does something like that. So this is fine. This is okay. I think I should just redraw this hand. I can't pl actually play anything here. Naked Gnome is going at it. want to just go for the kill on if I can't I'm just gonna try going for the kill on Big Lou then we freeze yeah then we'll just freeze Gromble and walk away feels like you're putting your units at too much risk if you keep the fight going the snake and gnome feels very scary I, I not I'm gonna see if he can find Foxy. <sighs> Damn. I'll take Snoffle. Snoffle could be the good support. Could be good support. In fact, I'll actually take the crown off Wart and put it on Snoffle. I think Snoffle's gonna be overall better. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Let me cook. Let me cook. Let me cook. So what we do here. Crown this. I'm going to take the crown off Snoffle. Let, let me cook. Let me cook. <laughs> oh god, this looks awful, but it looks pretty funny. So, yeah. We're gonna use today. We're gonna be using one of the what I generally can't think is one of the worst charms in the game. Peppernut charm, when shield gain spice instead. Usually, the, the reason this is bad is because shell is pretty is almost always just more valuable than spice. But on a unit. That get benefits a lot from spice. I don't know, man. Could be kind of decent. Not really. It's gonna be. T it's gonna be kind of terrible. Okay. Uh. <laughs> yeah, I. You know, I. <laughs> I was gonna say like, hey, 18 spies. But I've literally had a run on this channel where I've got it. To one. Th one th 12,800 spice, so this is not really, I'm not really, like, breaking any records here. Ain't exactly blowing anyone's sock, ain't exactly blowing any socks off. Now, it's still a lot of attack, don't get me wrong. Still a good, a nice and strong smack. But it could be... It's not that great. I need to kill this puffball. We're in some trouble here, man. 
We're in some real trouble. Is there any value? No, yeah, there is value in this. You Sunrod Snaffle. No, I gotta think. Do I... Damn, I was kind of hoping to draw like, a scrappy sword here. Do I have to let Snuffle die? I might have to let Snuffle die to get out of this safely. Is that necessary, though? I'm not sure. This is such a stupid line. This is super dumb. This is really not- this is really dumb. I think I do, I think I want to use Snow Stick on the Puffball. Because I need this Puffball dead next turn. Yeah. Oh, what do I do? Fuck! It's fine. Oh, God. Fuck me. Okay. So, the leader goes down to one. Oh, this ain't good one bit, Chief. Chief, this isn't... Chief, this is not good one bit. I... There's not much I can do. There's not much I can do to stop this. I need to play Mimic here, because I need a kill both of the and then I think I let Mimic die here I need more spice I, just, I don't have enough I don't have enough to make the kill give the HP to the moon in case the moon has to tank anything What's your HP at? 40 out of 40. Um, we'll err on the side of safety here. Oh, wait, no. We're good. Great try to actually save. Actually made that. Concluded that there. Chuckle Charm. I, yes, we definitely take Chuckle Charm. Where, Chuckle Charm, where were you, like, two runs ago? <laughs> Where were you during the Shen run? <laughs> Cries. Now we can find good charms and just give them the naked now. I think this is good. Now have I ever mentioned this is a <laughs> this is a really this is a really really silly idea. This is an incredibly silly idea we're doing. Just an absurdly silly idea. But, uh... Ha 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 ha! Ha ha I'm just a little... Ah, oh, wait, fuck, you have snow. Piece of shit. Piece of shit, I'll show you! Piece of shit, I... I need to make Mimic out here. I need a... Fuck. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Alright, actually, I can do something really risky looking. Well, then if I do that, this Mimic dies. No, not if I put Mimic up here. So this is gonna look incredibly risky, what I'm about to do. But we get... But... Bomb bomb gets snowed. Alright, the moon needs to move up here. Oh god. Having naked naked gnome kill stuff so slowly. It's not fun one bit. I need to redraw this hand. I need a freeze ace. I need snow sticks ASAP. Okay. We kill one of the and I do just, and I will just let. 
yeah, okay. This turn, I'm going to use... No, this turn, I'm going to Snowstick Warthog. Mimic dot. Mimic dies, but that's fine. This hasn't really been a Mimic run. And that's okay with me. And then we kill the other Warthog. Then we kill the Hog. Alright, okay. Let's ho let's hope. I think I I'm confident I oh uh I just realized Bomb Bomb might be in a bit of trouble. Uh, Bomb Bomb. I need to think here. Okay. This is... R Wait, no, I... Okay. This is really risky what I'm about to... This is gonna look really scary on what I'm about to do. But... Oh, wait, no, but I, I need Naked Numb to hit... Okay. Hold on, I need to workshop this. <laughs> If I give you pink berry juice, wait, if I give you pink berry juice, you'll have 9 HP, you'll go into the cell. Okay, okay. I think I found the line. The line where you get out with no deaths. The line where you get out with no deaths, a hit on Razor, and still have your snow stick for next turn. So you can stop Razor from attacking, because that's really what we're trying to do here. Okay, we're good. We got it. I did it correctly. I did it. I did it right. So now we just snow stick razor and we get out of this. Ooh, that kind of spooky there. A little bit spooky. This is six damage. Yeah, the moon survives this. It's fine. These while these hogs are wet, rather wild, their leader is dead. Get out of here. Get out of here and never return. <laughs> no. Game, I don't appreciate you not giving me a shop in this final circle. Okay, I actually do. I Okay, I, I take back what I said. I do appreciate it. That's incredible. Demon Ice, Demon Ice Charm here is legitimately incredible. It gives us the ability to kill, to kill Frost Jailer much faster. This sure is one silly line, but you know what? I I wouldn't have it any other way. My silly little spicy gnome. It, you know, like, when you look at gnome, it, this is kind of fitting, actually, because the top of Naked Gnome's head ca looks a little bit like a... Uh, looks a little bit like a pepper. If you squint your eyes enough. I don't really want to hit Frost Garden, although I do kill Rock. Eh, it's not that good. I think it should be fine. We have one scary unit left. And that's... Uh... Yeah, we have one scary unit... Left, and that... And it's... Uh... And that's, uh... What's its name? And that's the spike wall that spawns here. I need to recall Bomb Bomb here. I can't let Bomb Bomb explode. Alright, enjoy the damage. 
Yeah, I'm. I need to kill the spike wall because I. Oh, huh. That doesn't. Yeah, I was kind of expecting that to. Uh. Huh. I was kind of expecting that it would. Uh, that mimic mimic would trigger there. I mean, it does say when an ally in row attack in row attacks. Uh, a keyword being attacks, which. Uh, <laughs> Keyword being a tax, which n which Snuffle doesn't do. He just kind of sits in his big snowy cloud and <laughs> shits all shits all over the enemy. Sorry, I'm not gonna get it. Ow! Fuck you, Uber Bear! He can't keep getting away with this. He can't keep getting away. This piece of shit. I will have his soul. I don't want... Let's see here. I don't want... I don't want my naked gnome being frozen. I feel like it just causes too many problems. Yeah, it's gonna be a very slow... It's gonna be a very slow kill, but it will be a kill. So now that I look at it, we actually do have a kind of a hard time. Ah, shit. I need to move these. Alright, this is fine. You need to play Bomb Bomb here. Also, I'll, just in case I forget, I'm gonna take the screenshot. Naked Gnome, and also I need to... I want to take... Okay. I need to take another screenshot at the start of the next, at the start of the next combat. To... This, this run is just, this run is so good. This run is just so goofy. It, we're using what I, I consider to be one of the. Get out of here, bomb bomb. <laughs> bomb bomb, get the hell out of here. I don't like you here. To end this quicker, I'm actually gonna freeze the moon. I'm gonna piss on the moon. Okay, now we get the double damage with we get substantially more damage thanks to demonize. And now we are close to the kill. Freeze the spike. Freeze this winter worm. Ooh, wait, no, I want to do something. I want to flex. I want to flex. Recall Naked Gnome. Yeah, I want to flex here. Wait, uh, shit. I, I did that wrong. I should have. Uh, mm, erm, okay. Uh, redraw. Redraw, I want to flex here. Damn it! Can I still flex? No, I can't. Uh, I made the mistake. I wanted to do the. I wanted to, to play Scrappy. I wanted to kill Frost Garden with Scrappy Sword so that I could get the achievement on the save file again. Uh, but that's not possible. It's. It is not. Or uh, mm, is it? Mm, um, uh, <laughs> I'm thinking. I'm thinking. Is this possible? No. I, I'm. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not risking it. Just die. Just please get, get out of my face, Frost Guardian. I don't want to, I don't want to risk that. Maybe there's a line you can come up there, up. Maybe there's a line you can come up with where you kill, where you kill, oh, so wait, where you kill Frost Guardian with the shell with, with the scrappy sword, but I don't want to find, I don't feel like finding it also. I'm taking the screenshot of this shell shield because this is a very funny component to this run. This, the shot I got is way too sideways. That's even more sight. Okay, that's good. Wrong, wrong lane, wrong lane, wrong lane, wrong lane. Extremely the wrong lane. Also, I don't know if we win this. I am not confident that we win this.
it does not seem particularly possible to me here. Just freeze the... No, I, I need to get... Okay, I need to get bomb bomb on this top top lane. Okay, and yeah, this is good. You play Sun Charm and you get the kill here. So that's a good start. That's the correct start. Let's play Snuffle here, although it's it's really hard to get Snuffle to do anything here. Ugh. Okay. I need to think. This looks fine. I would like to try to keep Snuffle alive, though. Unfortunately, I think this is how you gotta roll it. I'm gonna... Let's play Woodhead up here. Because Woodhead creates a chance that Bomb Bomb doesn't get hit by Frost Lancer. I'm pretty sure this is right. So. Although, it's, it's... It sure ain't pretty... Damn, we got... Um, we got... Oh, God. Oh, Lord. Oh, that's not pretty. Okay. 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 All right, all righty. Uh, I think I'm dead. <laughs> Let me cook. Let... Uh... It's really tough. It's real. It's really, really hard here. But it might be possible to... To eke out of this alive. It might be possible. Don't hold your breath, though. Don't, don't, yeah, don't hold your breath. Or, uh, is that really the right saying? Thing to say, don't hold your breath. There's no reason I'm... Uh, wait. Mm. I gotta think about something. So, is there value in here? Value here? On playing... No, I don't. I'm trying to think. How do I get out of this alive? Because it. I think you actually might have. Okay. This is 8 health. Naked Gnome has 5. If I play this plus Pinkberry Juice, you'll be up to. 13. That is enough to survive to attack. An attack from Frost Bomber. I think it's the right play. I think. I hope this is the right play, what I'm about to do. Oh, wow. Is this. Cl okay. Yeah, now we get even more health. By God, he might have done it. Then I kill... Then I kill Frost Crusher. He gets it done. He gets it done. He should be out of this alive. He... Damn! Damn, that was close. We actually get out of this alive. Holy shit. Good job, Naked No. Good job, Naked No. You did it. I, I knew you had it. I knew you had it, buddy. I never I never doubted you for a second. Oof. Oof. Scary. Spooky one. Feels good. To, feels good to be able to eke out with a close run. Okay. Nice one. Good. Nice. Yeah, look at that. One HP leader. Nice close. Juicy close one. Dare I say it? A spicy close one. 
Also apply 98, highest damage level 74, highest spice reach 38, friendly damage 67, naked gnome spared 1. He sure was. How many naked gnomes do I have spared on the save file? Don't judge my win rate. Blink. Friends renamed. Uh, smack. Where, where is it? <laughs> I, okay, I just, I noticed something funny about, about these statistics. Uh, where, where the, where the hell is gnome? Where the hell are, are gnomes spared? Are they not listed here? It says goblins escaped. Car cards munch. Goblin hits. Smackback. Companions recalled. Okay, you know. Naked, no naked gnomes killed. F 40. Oh. Well, I was kind of hoping you'd show me naked gnomes I spared, but okay. <laughs> 20. 28. 28. 1,605 spice. And this is all from that one foxy run. Uh, feels good. That's gonna do for this episode of Wild Frost. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure to please think about hitting that like button and especially that subscribe button. I'll catch you guys later.